Okay guys, how I make money blogging. This has been an overdue video. I have been thinking about making this video and wanting to make this video for over six months now. Now there are a lot of people who ask me, how much do I make money blogging? How do I make it? How do I do that? Is it for real? How can they start, etc, etc. Now in this video, I will give you an overview of what I do and what I recommend so you can get started as well. Now before we move any further, I'm in the process of creating an extremely extensive free guide which is over 100 pages. Yes, I know that's a lot, but it helps you start the blog the right way. I talk about the tech behind it, I talk about various WordPress settings, how to install Google Analytics, Google Search Console, etc, etc. And as a bonus, I'm giving away 17 tips to drive traffic to a new blog by six-figure bloggers and a checklist to know what to focus on and what not to focus on. If you want to get your hands on it, you can join the waitlist. The link is in the first comment below. I'm almost done with it, so you will have it in your inbox by next week. Anyway, enough of all that. Let's talk about how I make money blogging so you can too. Now, because we already use the word WordPress, I'm going to talk about the tech side of blogging for a little bit. When I started out, I was really afraid. I was timid. So I started with a free WordPress blog. So it was mrsdakustudio.wordpress.com. I blogged over it for months together before I realized that you cannot monetize it or work with brands if you have this. It's a credibility issue as well. So if you want to make money blogging, get yourself a self-hosted website. Now, it may sound very technical to a lot of you. So let me begin with the basics. Now, blogging has four moving parts. And the first one is going to be your domain name. Your domain name is the URL that you type. So mine is mrsdakustudio.com. Think of this as an address to your house. You can get a cheap domain name on a platform name, name cheap. Now, the second part of this is hosting. Now, hosting is like your house. This is where you house your blog. I recommend you either buy hosting from Big Scoots or from SiteGround. Both of them are really great. The third part of your blog is going to be your content management system and you will be using WordPress.org. Now this comes free with the hosting so you don't need to worry about it a lot. A content management system is like the walls of your house. So it helps you build posts, build pages, write content, etc. It helps you create a structure. This is where you're going to log in and going to write a post. The fourth one is the theme, the look and feel, the aesthetics of your house. You can select a free theme to begin with and for that I recommend you go with Astra. So these are the four basic tech parts of your blog you need to understand. It is not as complicated as it may sound like right now. It will take you maximum one hour from buying your domain name, hosting, installing WordPress to writing your first post. I cover all this in detail in my freebie so you know where to find it in the first link in the description box below. This is a very important aspect of how I make money blogging. Your hosting is actually the foundation of how you're going to build a blog, a profitable blog. So you will need to spend money on it at first even if you're making no money. There is no way around it. There is absolutely no way around it. I spent a lot of time on free platform but when I shifted I lost my readership. And it was double the work because I had to shift all my blog posts from one platform to the other one. It was a hodgepodge and you don't want that. So that's the tech part of how I make money blogging. The second part is going to be traffic. Now without traffic, you cannot really make any money online. You need to learn how to do this. So when I started out, I was all over the place. I did Pinterest, I was focusing on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, search engine optimization, etc. I was overwhelmed and I quit blogging even before I started making a penny. So don't do this mistake. Don't repeat this mistake. Start out with one platform before you move on to the next one. Now my first recommendation is going to be Pinterest. Now Pinterest is the fastest way of driving social traffic right now or you can start with SEO but it is going to be a little slower but a more stable way to drive traffic. Now, if your blogging topic works well with Pinterest, I would say go with that first because it's going to be fast and it will keep you motivated. And that's what I did. At eight months in, I was getting 30,000 page views a month with Pinterest alone. Now, I started working on SEO around 10 months into serious money-making blogging. So now I get over 100,000 page views in a month. 
Now let me tell you that this 100,000 page views is actually a combination of all of my traffic strategies. So it includes Pinterest, SEO, Facebook, email list and a lot of other things as well. Now as a beginner blogger, you should start out with Pinterest and then move on to SEO. You can do both of them together, but if it overwhelms you, start with one. I have two resources to recommend the ones that I used and I will link it in the description box below. Grab at least one of them right now if you want to make money blogging as soon as possible. So that's about traffic. Now again, if you want to grab 17 tips from six bigger bloggers on how to drive traffic to a new blog, you know where to find that. Sign up for my new freebie. The link is in the description box below. It is a bonus and I will be sending, a sending it along with the guide. Now the third part of money making blogging is going to be monetization. Three months in blogging at around 5,000 page views in a month, I made my first $100. It was with affiliate marketing. For those of you who don't know, affiliate marketing is basically promoting someone else's product in your content. Now, when a reader clicks on it, makes a purchase, I get a commission at no extra cost to the buyer. This is what affiliate marketing is. So this $100 was because of a virtual assistant course that I promote for which I get 30% commission. Now I love this course. I trust the person who created it and I trust it enough to recommend it to my readers. The one tip that I have for you is to not recommend things that you don't trust. You can lose the trust of your readers and that's something you don't want. That's how I made my first $100. Um, now I make anywhere from $2,000 to $3,000 in affiliate marketing. And that is because I have a lot of traffic. I'm not going to disclose the affiliate programs I'm a part of here in this video, but here are, here are a few examples of lifetime earnings that would be around 24 months. So this is offer juice. This is one course. This is another course that I promote. Now, besides all this, I have ads on my blogs. Now, every time we talk about ads, new bloggers talk about AdSense. Now, I do not recommend using AdSense at all. Not only does it slow down your website, it looks like a mess. When I used it, someone really told me that your site looks scammy and she closed it. She, she didn't go any further. So, so that's something that you need to keep in mind that AdSense will show a lot of ads and it will start looking scammy. So I removed it and I never recommend it to anyone. I wouldn't use it at all. I recommend three ad companies instead of that. At 10,000 page views, you can join Monumetric. At 50,000 sessions, you can join Mediawine and stay with them. At 100,000 sessions, you can join AdThrive. I don't plan to shift because I love to work with Mediawine and the pay is almost the same, so it does not make sense for me. A lot of people don't. Now, I told you that eight months in, I was at 30,000 page views and this is how I qualified for Mediawine, which had a threshold of 25,000 sessions back then. They have increased it to 50,000 sessions right now. So that's what you need to achieve to work with Mediawine. I started having a more regular income, more stable income once I joined Mediawine. So I make anywhere from $1,500 to $4,500 in a month with advertisements. I know that is a big discrepancy and there is a lot of difference between the numbers, but it really depends on what month it is. And the best months are during the holiday seasons and the Christmas seasons, of course. The third way that I've monetized my blog is by selling my own product. I promote them in my blog posts, in YouTube videos, on Pinterest, to my email marketers, to my Facebook group people, etc. In about 11 months, I have made around $1,500, which is pretty less. I've made a lot of mistakes along the way and now I've finally invested in a course which teaches me how to create sales funnels, how to write copy, how to write emails and how to persuade people to buy your products, which costed me around $700, but it is an amazing course. Which gets me to my last point. I tried, I tried to make it work without spending a penny on blogging education, and that's a mistake that I did. Blogging has a very steep learning curve, and there is no way you can figure out how to do something profitably and how to do something fast without the help of other bloggers and their courses. Over the past 24 months that I have been seriously blogging, I have spent $5,000 on blogging education and it is the only way, it is only because of that I could make this kind of progress in only two years of time. Overall, I make anywhere from $3,000 to $7,000 in a month, which is a full-time income and both my husband and I could quit our jobs because of this. We have plans to expand it and do a lot more with our blog and we'll see how that goes. I'll make a video maybe in a few months to come. 
hoping to get to ten thousand dollars mark soon but this is how i make money blogging if you want to make money blogging my advice is to get yourself a self-hosted blog focus on pinterest and then on seo learn affiliate marketing right from the start if you have any doubts feel free to comment below and let me know do not forget to grab the blogging freebie because it's going to give you a head start there is so much information in it that i wish i knew when i started out the link is in the description box below it's the first link so go check it out sign up for it that is it for this video this is how i make money blogging and this is what i recommend uh, if you have any doubts you can comment below and let me know if you want me to cover different aspect of blogging or how to do something i would love to make more videos on blogging because i love it i do it full time i'll see you next week and till then have a happy weekend Ta da